I'm Natalie Sawyer, the butcher here at Ironside Fish and Oyster, and today we're going to be breaking down a swordfish caught by local fisherman Kelly Fukushima. First, we're going to take off the collar. I'm going to cut through the bottom of the collar, and then I will find the bone here, trace along, and take off the first side of the collar. Next, I'm going to take off the tail just by going straight through, and I'm going to try and hit in between the bones where the vertebrae and the bone marrow is. Missed. Next, I am going to make my first cut from the back of the tail through to the belly, and I'm only going to go to the back one. And then I'm going to do the same to the back side. I'm just going to flip it around one more time so that I can pull it off more easily. Now I'm going to lift up the tail and I'm just going to slowly tap away any connective tissue. Now I'm going to flip the swordfish around and take the other side of the collar off and do exactly what I did before on the back. I'm going to flip over and do the belly. And I'm going to flip over and then take the bones off. So here we have the swordfish marrow. A lot of people will pop these open like so. And you can just shoot them as is. You can mix them with some herbs or finger lime. It's pretty much like the jello shot of the ocean. Now that I've taken one side off, I'm gonna take the belly off and cut all the way down the center to separate each loin. I'm gonna make sure that I make long, even strokes to prevent any chopping on the meat. Now that I've separated the loin, I'm gonna clean it up a little before I remove the skin. I'm gonna remove any of this little connective tissue or skin from the belly. Now I'm gonna flip the loin and take off some of this bloodline. Again, I'm using long, even strokes. You can take just the skin off, or I like to take that layer of fat off with the skin just to save a little bit of time. The top line I'm actually gonna cut in half real quick just to make it a little bit easier and get more even strokes that way.
And now I'm gonna do the other half real quick. Now we have our swordfish lined out and ready to portion. Here at Ironside, we're gonna portion probably about 45 ounce fillets a day. That'll take up maybe half of it. And then we'll save the other half for tomorrow.